The PS5 has secrets, and the gamer is here to expose them. We're going to talk about its undercover functions and features, and maybe some things you already know about but need to see again so you can say to the video game gods, I knew that. Here are 10 secret things about the PS5. Normal or professional, simple or regular, assisted, standard, hardcore, nightmare or inferno. Every decision you make in life wears on you. That's why you can opt to preset your preferred difficulty for your PS5 games so you can start off your sessions in tip-top mental and emotional gaming shape. For games that support this feature, you can also choose whether to automatically put you in performance or resolution mode, save your favorite camera control settings, and decide all your in-game subtitle settings well in advance. So if you're trying to read en français while swinging through the New York skyline, you can have those French subtitles automatically appear in Miles Morales as well as in all your other games to help you reach your goal. You hit hard. Subliminal brand marketing is the name of the game in this semi-hidden PS5 feature. Like the way the dollar bills have hidden patterns and messages, the DualSense controller grip is branded with miniature X's, O's, triangles, and circles, making it easier to spot the real controllers from the fakes. Look for more of that pattern on the inside of the PS5's panels to make sure you got a Sony Authentic, and not a big fat phony. For those of us who are more on the modest side of the moon and want to keep private things private, that's easier than ever with the PS5's pre-made privacy profiles. You've got social and open for gaming exhibitionists, team player for those of us that like to keep tighter circles, friend focused so only your gaming homies can see what you're doing, and solo and focused for when you're cheating on your Call of Duty faction with a younger, hotter team. Just don't get caught. Hell hath no fury as a soldier scorned. If you are hearing impaired or in a situation in which you cannot play with volume, you can set up your PS5 to convert other players' voice chat to text so you can follow along with the group without feeling left behind. Ghost of Tsushima. The screen reader will be available in all PS5s, and you can adjust the voice type and speed to accommodate your needs. If I had my eyes, I would show you its splendor myself. Wonderful news for visually impaired gamers like YouTuber Steve Saylor, Blind Gamer. And for some quickie tippies and trickies, you can tap the R1 button to auto-complete your words. Just don't press it and send without verifying first. You can also hit L3 to send emojis right quick for those of us who have trouble expressing our true feelings. I never thought I'd meet anyone more defensive than I am. And yet... Too many games, huh? For those of us with those kinds of champagne problems, the PS5 has a caviar answer in the form of its UI triage. You can filter your games by platform, real simple-like, so your PS3, PS4, and PS5 games can stay with their own kind, where they belong. You can also easily see where you got a game from, because sometimes you've got to know whether you got a game from the PlayStation Store, PS Plus, or PS Now, if for no other reason than your personal accounting purposes. And finally, you can see where each game is installed fast, extra useful for those of us using external hard drives like MAD. Hoarders are gonna love this one. When you earn a trophy, a screenshot of the moment you got it is automatically saved onto the console. You can also get a 15 second video to go along with it if you can spare the drive space. That way, you can relive the moment of that achievement over and over again. Which would be really fun for some of those super hard to get trophies like this one from GTA 5. Favorite them so you can make them show up quicker in your media gallery, so you can re-experience the magic of when you first got that very first PS5 trophy. Trophy hunters now have a system that keeps track of your life's work, giving your gaming life a true witness. New trophy levels and icons are coming as well for the Lara Croft level seekers, with a brand new platinum trophy icon at the top of the totem pole available for the sickos who reach level 999 and above. Those are the real heroes if you ask me. That's your pearl of wisdom? Look who it is! None but the high one! If you've got the attention span of a squirrel, hey, did you know that Conan O'Brien and Andy Richter were in Halo 4? Never awaken an alien from an ancient slum.
Anyway, if you've got a short attention span and... Hey, remember when Shaquille O'Neal was in UFC Undisputed 2010? Okay, okay, yes, I know. Hurry up, Ryan. If you've got a miniature attention span and the patience of a gamer... I shake it off! The PS5 has Switcher in its control center. Simply pause your game and move right into another game which you've previously saved. No precious seconds are wasted returning to the home screen. And if you want to switch games even faster, from the Switcher, go to the game you want to play's hub, which will allow you to access the game's activity cards so you can start playing without having to fully start it. Get used to using activity cards and the world will be yours. Oh yeah, and remember when Jimmy Kimmel was in COD Black Ops 2? And remember when many years later Jimmy made this joke about gamers? Watching other people play video games is a double waste of time, and it turns out... So yes, I would use Switcher like mad. If you're the type who's tired of being tired of being tired of trailers spoiling content for you by showing you the whole story... It's time. You can politely ask your PS5 to warn you about spoilers. You can even choose to have either everything you haven't seen blocked or only block stuff flagged by developers as spoilers. To make sure you actually have a first time every time experience with all games, this will also ensure that if you make PS5 content reaction videos, that you can go full method and not have to fake it. It'd be cool to see this scene again for the first time. Hi, stranger. Spoiler alert. <laughs> Do you notice anything on my head? You can manage your PS5 storage from your smartphone. You can buy games and start their download from the line at the grocery store so by the time you get home, Hitman 3 will be ready for these so you can fire off a few shots of your silencer before putting away the honeycombs. It'd be nice if you help me. And if you've got content on there you don't want mama to find, delete it from your phone so that when your maternal helicopter goes snooping through your console, she won't find out you bought Cyberpunk 2077 against her wishes. And then, of course, re-download it again after dark. Just don't tell her the gamer told you to do it. Do you think maybe I could talk to you in the kitchen for a second? If you did, though, she'd probably think you were crazy, and she'd send you to see Dr. William Beckham. Stop hoping for somebody to save you who suspiciously looks like Johnny Silverhand. Weird. Coincidence? I think not. Stop waiting for life to be easy. Say you're playing a game and something you don't want anyone to hear starts happening. Maybe that same helicopter mama or that new helicopter girlfriend who's been hanging around is sleeping lightly in the next room. When that unexpected ultra-wild cutscene starts happening and the TV remote is lost between the couch cushions, press this mute button on the DualSense for a few seconds and voila! You've got yourself your very own quiet place. Great for certain sections of The Last of Us Part 2. You know what I'm talking about when Abby and Owen become one. What did you think about all these secret functions the PlayStation 5 can do? Did it just make you mad you can't get one? Or are you one of the mythical creatures who actually has one and you learned something new? Let us know in the comments below, and like and sub for more from the gamer. Happy New Year!